in this video, we will be seeing if we can survive via riddles, I guess. I don't know. But one thing I got to do to survive today is drink this Red Bull. That was a struggle. So am I. I'm on a struggle bus today. I'm tired. I stayed up way too late playing video games last night, and I'm hurting right now. But babe, do you think we're going to survive these riddles? I think that we are going to survive and thrive. I don't think so. I feel like if me and Claire Bear were trapped in the wild, having to survive, she would hit me and eat me, probably. That's probably what would happen. And I obviously can't hit back because she would have already hit me. Yeah. Eat me. I would eat you. I mean, <laughs> that's prime rib right there. Let's get looking at these freaking riddles. Jesus. A werewolf hunter was invited to a remote village. This guy looks like he's a freaking savage. Every full moon, a local person turned into a werewolf. Ooh, that's scary. That's a good looking werewolf. Uh, and killed people. Jesus, man. Look at all these dead people, bro. Nobody could figure out who he or she was. The hunter hid in the bush bushes to watch. Oh, uh, you're reading skills sometimes. <laughs> The next morning, he brought all the locals together. I know who it was. And identified the werewolf. Oh, I already know who it is, yeah, too. We all know who it is. We all know who it is. On the count of three, babe. Three, two, one. The yellow girl. jacket. Oh. It's the yellow jacket. How is it the yellow jacket? Look at the guy's leg, and then look at this freaking idiot. They both have the same little scar oh. thing. You're going to jail, boy. You're going to jail. You're smart. You would survive, and I would not. I mean, if there's a werewolf, I'm probably not surviving. I don't think anyone is, but sucks for you, bro. They have the same scar. You hate to see it. All right, this one says, a king decided to execute an astrologer. Wait, is that how you say that? Astrologer. Astrologer. Uh, astrologer. Astrologer. But before the king asked him, what would he ask him? When will, when I, will die? I die? Jeez, dude, what are all these about dying? I mean, I guess, I guess it's survival. What should the astrologer, how do you say that? Astrologer! What should the astrologer say to say, to say, to stay alive? Okay, so can we like flashback to two minutes ago when you said I suck that reading? Well, because you know I said what? bush instead of bushes. Well, you know what? Oh, your reading skills sometimes. <laughs> But I have no idea. I wasn't really paying attention because your reading was horrific. What should the astrologer say to stay alive? He should say, you're going to die right now. He should say, you're going to die when I die. Ooh, you're really good at these. I think that's going to be the correct answer. There's no way that's the correct answer. But right? then he won't kill him. Maybe. I have no idea. You will die the day I die. I didn't even know what was going on and I got it right. So who's the astrologer here? Is it the star guy? Ow, you kissed my like eyeball. Ow. The astrologer Ow. is the wizard. Oh, the wizard, Harry Potter. Harry Potter. There we go, I'm two for two. Claire is O oh for two. You hate to see it. All right, Pirate John was captured and sentenced to be shot. Ooh. I don't think they did this back in the pirate days. They kind of pushed him off the plank. You remember that? As a joke, the general let John uh, arrange 50 soldiers to execute him. How is oh, this a gosh. joke? John came up with an ingenious plan and stayed alive. Ooh. What was his ingenious plan? I know it. How did he arrange them? Oh, got it. How do you already know this? I got it. I think he put them all in a line. So when they shoot, they each shoot the person in front of them. So they end up not shooting him. But the last person in line is going to be pointed at him. No, because they shoot in this order. And then he ducks. I know it's something like that. Or he puts them in a circle. That's what I think. Oh, yeah. They surround him. So I was technically right. They surround him or I and was point the gun right. towards each other. I was technically right. Yeah. Right. No, I mean, technically speaking, I got it right. I mean, technically speaking, I got it right. Whatever. I think you're right, though. I think they surrounded him in a circle. John told them to form a circle around him. That is a horrible looking circle, by the way. Well, I guess everyone goes home happy today. No one got shot. Cool. You're on a desert island covered with dry plants. Ooh, dry plants. I like dry plants. The water is teeming with piranhas. Piranhas! I'm a piranha from the Amazon. If this is gonna say, how are you gonna get food? Uh, piranhas don't eat humans. A fierce fire broke oh, out. Oh no, oh no, no, look at that fierce fire. Oh no. And the wind's blowing you away. Oh no, the fire's spreading right towards you, buddy. The dried grass on the island is gonna burn you. You, can't, you can't touch the water in any way. Why? I don't know. How, how would, would you survive? survive? Well, I guess what I would do, go into the water because piranhas don't eat humans. But you can't go into the water. You can't even touch the water. I would, oh, this is actually a tough one, babe. Maybe rip the grass out and form a line. Ooh, okay, okay, Maybe okay, I don't. okay, okay. I don't know if I'd have time. Oh gosh, what's happening? 
Use a branch to bring some fire. And set the whole island on? Ah, uh, I feel like that would not work. I feel like that wouldn't work like at all. That, that literally wouldn't work at all. There's literally no shot that would work. Like, you see how quick that fire spread? This is not good survival advice. Yeah, if you're if you're in an island with piranhas, piranhas, you're gonna probably die anyway, so take your chance in the water. Mike was going to spend a great time at sea. Look at Mike, looking all freaking happy and He's bearded, cool. like you. Yeah, he is. And go to Mexico by bus. He's gonna bring that surfboard on a little bus. That no, surfboard. No, that's, that's not a little bus. That's a big bus. I don't even think that's a bus. I think that's more of a van. Unfortunately, he lost his ticket. Oh, oh no. no, yeah, I hate to see it. And forgot which bus he was to go by. So like, which bus he's supposed to get on? Um. Oh, 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 which bus goes to Mexico? Well, that um, looks like it has like, wait. number eight. Gosh. Yeah, that eight. One, that one has stuff in it. That one has a Canada thing on yeah, it. Yeah, it's eight. eight. It's too easy. That one goes to Canada. Oh, I was like, wait, what? The bottom one goes to the- A fishing place. No, I think that's- Oh, a skiing Yeah, it goes place. to the north. I was gonna say that was a skiing pool. And then eight is for Mexico. Here we go. Oh, we have a family Whoa. looking like they're in a hostage. Is that an alien? Oh. Nina's family are held hostage at their house. Wow, that would suck to be held hostage Ooh. in your own home. Suddenly, the phone rings. Ding! The criminal allows Nina to take the phone. Pick up the phone, Nina. But she can't reveal the situation. She said, Hi, Mom. How can I help you? I am home and about to go to bed. If it's not an emergency, can I call you later? I'm really sleepy. Okay, I'm confused. 30 minutes later, the police arrived and rescued them. What? I have no idea. How did Nina ask for help? Hi. Here, let's pause. Let's Hi, pause. how I'm too if and can call I'm. Dang it, I thought it was going to be the first word of ever. Hi, mom. How can I help you? I'm home and about to go to bed. If it's not an emergency, can I call you later? I'm really sleepy. Maybe that's their key word. Wait, if it's not an emergency, can I call you later? Which means if it is an emergency, she won't call. Boom, easy, get on my face. Like literally, I'm too smart for these freaking riddles, babe. You need to turn it up a little bit or I'm gonna get bored of doing these riddles because they're too easy. I just, it's like I'm not even right. There's a chance, <laughs> there's a chance I'm not even right. Let's see, come on, tell me I'm right. She held the mute button saying everything except the words help. Oh, emergency call. Like literally, I'm too smart for these freaking riddles, babe. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Are you kidding me? Oh, someone got a little too cocky. But look at this. If it's not an emergency, can I call you later? That's stupid. Like that, they set me up. I didn't know what kind of phone. Like do phones even have mute buttons on that type of phone? And the guy that's here go, hi mom, can I? Help. She you. was like this. She was just holding it like this, muting it. A scientist was exploring an ice cave in Antarctica. This Wait, guy needs a hat. Let's talk about his beard. Like, hopefully that beard is keeping him warm. Look at his head. You can't judge his beard. Look at his head. It's literally a circle. What a psychopath. When an avalanche fell. Oh, are you sorry. Are you reading your mind? Sorry. An avalanche fell and closed the way he came from. Oh no. He found four other tunnels. Oh, this is getting scary. All of them are deadly, but one. Oh my God. Ooh, bear trap. Ooh, Scary. Okay. Don't step in that. Whoa. Watch out. Dangerous whale. Whoa, Ooh, look at that, that guy. Whale. Jesus. Wait, who would ever make a dale of a dale? <laughs> who, would, who would ever make a whale dangerous? Poisonous underground gases. Oh man. Oh man. And an a, abyss. Abyss with an icy lake at the bottom. Which one is safe? It's got to be the, the abyss with the yeah. icy lake at the bottom because that means that he's going to land in a lake, which means land should be near. I mean, whales don't attack humans. Jesus Christ. Okay, well then don't say that it's a scary yeah, whale. Then like, if, you, if it's a freaking whale and it's looking at me like this, how am I supposed to know? I'm not a scientist. I'm not a biologist. I don't know the whale's biology, okay? Yeah, well, apparently me and Claire are completely screwed if we uh, if we go into a survival situation that is not involving werewolves changing into people and then changing back into people. Yeah, I don't know. I think that you win this one and that you would probably live a lot longer than me. By minutes. 
I don't think I'd survive days longer, probably minutes, maybe. But make sure before you leave to like and subscribe, and we will see you guys in the next one. Bye! I'm so sick of you. Huh? <laughs> Vegans.